I am Saori Yamakita from Japan. I study city and transportation planning in the Department of Civil and Environmental Engineering. My interest in this field goes back to my childhood where I used to love looking at night view with sparkling city lights. Not only they are beautiful, but there are warmth in each lighting and as a, together as a city light, I felt like they were representing the diverse living of the people in the area. From this background, I've gained a great interest in the field of city planning and the factors affecting city ambience and the people's living. And this led to my current research on the relationship between the travel demand and also the city ambience through the use of three-dimensional virtual reality envisioning the city's future. In general, transportation demand is thought to decrease because of the population decline, and this is especially crucial in the non-metropolitan areas. However, by approaching the aesthetic demand from non-mobility human-based choices, such as window scenery, attraction of a vehicle, and attraction of the city itself, we can even increase the demand and bring about a great impact in, on the city's revitalization. I believe this research could bring an argumentative demand forecasting techniques during the negotiation, planning, and assembling stages of large-scale city planning. My name is Jairo Lopez. I'm from Venezuela. I study at the Graduate School of Fundamental Science and Engineering, Department of Computer Science and Telecommunications Engineering. I am currently st studying next-generation networking, particularly wireless connectivity. So when I started researching about networks uh, 10 years ago, the, there wasn't the internet as we know it. And I didn't see the, the social networks that exist right now. I didn't know that we would use smartphones either. But there was this magic in being able to connect a lot of things together and being able to share information. Uh, 10 years have passed, and some of the issues that existed in the networks before, they haven't been solved. For example, mobility, uh, multi-homing, these sort of themes were interesting before and continue to be interesting right now. And this is the reason why I joined Wasela, to actually try to solve these problems. Uh, my name is Huang Xinhe from China, and uh, I'm now a master's student in the Department of Physics and Applied Physics. Uh, I am now doing research on cavity quantum electrodynamics in the field of quantum optics. The project is to create a quantum bit with single atoms and uh, laser. A quantum bit is equivalent to the binary bits 0 and 1 in classic computer. The it really implementation of prospect of this technology is quantum computer whose calculation speed is tremendously larger than that of classic electronic computer. The limited calculation speed at present will no more set ceiling on scientific research. I even firmly believe that quantum computation will lead the fourth uh, industrial revolution. Being a pioneer in this field is such an exciting idea to me. Since I was a child, I have been so attracted by magic stories, and my dream is to bring magic into real life. Physical technology builds the bridge between my dream and the real world. <laughs>